Hey everyone, Alec here with Veed, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to translate closed captions. So let's say you're a YouTuber and you want to reach an international audience. YouTube can automatically add closed captions to your videos, but it can't automatically translate them for you. So in this video I'm going to be showing you exactly how you can translate your closed captions from any language into any other language. That being said, let's get started. So to get started we're going to be using a tool called Veed, so we're going to head over to Google and Google Veed, which is V-E-E-D. And we're going to click on the first link, which is create, edit and share videos online. Now, if you don't already have an account with Veed, you'll be prompted to create a new one for free. And if you do already have an account, we're just going to click on the new project button. Now, this is where we're going to start uploading our video and translating the closed captions. So I'm going to click on the pink upload video button and select the video which has the closed captions that I want to translate. So now I'm going to head over to the subtitles tab. And if you already have your subtitle files, so this could be a .srt file a .ass or any other major subtitle files, you can go ahead and click on the upload subtitle file button. And if you don't already have a subtitle file, you can go ahead and use Veed's auto subtitle tool. And basically Veed will automatically detect all of the audio from your video and turn this audio into subtitles. But I actually have my own SRT file. So I'm going to click on the upload subtitle file. So this is my closed captions file that I want to translate. So I select it and click on open. Now, as we can see straight away, we have in the subtitle editor, my closed captions and then we have them in the timeline and if I click on play all right, so this is as you can see they're also being displayed on screen but because we don't want our subtitles hard-coded onto the actual video we're not going to be paying attention to this we only want our subtitles as closed captions so we're going to be downloading them again as a .srt file after we've translated them now to begin translating them we're going to click on this little language button in the top right in the subtitle editor so if I click on this Straight away, we can see that we have my default subtitles and then below that we have add subtitle track. So I'm going to click on add subtitle track and here I'm actually going to select the language that I want to translate my English subtitles into. So if I click on the language drop down menu, I'm going to start typing in French because I want to translate my closed captions into French. I click on French and then it's going to automatically translate them from the original. And then I'm going to click on the little plus button to the right of that. And then in a couple of seconds, Veed has automatically translated my closed captions into French. So now if I click on the edit button on the French closed captions, as we can see, my closed captions are all in French. So if I play it back from the beginning. All right, so this is my example video and we're going to be demonstrating sound. As you can see, I am talking in English, but my closed captions are in French. And if there's any mistakes or anything you want to change, you can go ahead and click in any of these bubbles. For an example, here I need to put, for this to be correct French, just le in front of if it's sonore, sound effects, just so the sentence is correct. And then once I'm happy with my translated closed captions, to download them again as a closed captions file, so a .srt file, I'm going to go to the options tab. And then here I'm going to click on download.srt. And if I click on this, as we can see, I have the closed captions that download as a zip file and then I can extract them to my desktop and then upload them with my video to platforms such as Facebook or YouTube, which are both two massive platforms that accept SRT files or closed captions. That being said, if you do want the closed captions hard-coded onto your video, so like to be permanent subtitles, we can just go ahead and click on the download button in the top right, and then Veed is actually gonna to start to render our video project with the subtitles hard-coded onto them, and then we can download it or share it to social media. That being said, if you have any questions about how to translate your closed captions, please let me know in the comment section down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you enjoyed this video and you found it helpful, please hit the like button, and if you wanna see more videos like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.